Hello everyone, my name is Adam Polacco. I am a senior at Georgetown University majoring in international economics. And today I will be giving you a tour of our beautiful campus. As you all know, this has been an exceptional year due to the current coronavirus pandemic. And our campus has been redesigned to implement certain health and safety protocols, which all students must follow in order to gain access into the building. So please come and join me on this tour. Georgetown University in Qatar opened its doors in 2005, but the university didn't transition to this new purpose-built campus, the Humanitarium Building, until January of 2011. The name Humanitarium is a combination of the words humanities and atrium, a major architectural feature in the building's design, which honors the Georgetown University's community's role in the study of the humanities. We'll visit the atrium a little bit later. The building's design includes landscaped courtyards and water features that create a tranquil atmosphere and provide beautiful spaces for the community to get together. The architectural design also reflects elements from Georgetown's campus in Washington, D.C. and from traditional building design here in the Gulf region. Georgetown was founded in 1789 by John Carroll, the first Catholic Archbishop of the United States, and is the oldest Catholic and Jesuit university in the United States. It is one of the 20 oldest universities in America. Today, it remains one of the world's foremost institutions for the study of international affairs and continues to train the next generation of global leaders. Georgetown University in Qatar was founded in 2005 through the generosity of Qatar Foundation. GUQ provides the exact same liberal arts education as Georgetown's campus in Washington, D.C. and is ranked with other top global institutions. GUQ started with about 25 students in 2005 and graduated its first class in 2009. It currently has about 405 enrolled students who represent over 50 nationalities. Each flag displayed in the atrium represents the nationality of one or more Georgetown students. Georgetown's diverse student body enhances the quality of education. Students debate global issues not just in the abstract but through personal experience. The cafeteria is the main dining option available in the Georgetown building. They offer decent, inexpensive, varied meal options for students, staff, and faculty. This year, with our community's safety in mind, we installed new dining facilities that conform to social distancing measures until we all convene again. The state-of-the-art Georgetown Library houses the best library collection for the study of international relations in the region with more than 90,000 books and 1.6 million e-books. Moreover, GUQ students have access to all eight of Georgetown's Washington, D.C. libraries, offering students up to 3 million volumes. The library houses two computer labs, group study rooms, individual study carrels, and desks. This facility, along with the entire GUQ building, is Wi-Fi capable. The library also is home to Georgetown's Writing Center. The Peer Writing Center is staffed by graduate and undergraduate students and is available to help all students with essays, papers, thesis development, structure, and organization. GUQ has four professional librarians with master's degrees in librarianship. Professional librarians co-teach with faculty to improve students' research skills. This year, our librarians are also offering virtual consultations. Currently, our library is open to students with a reserved building pass, and they can book a private cubicle to comfortably study in. The Center for International and Regional Studies, or CIRS, is GUQ's premier research institute devoted to the academic study of regional and international issues. CRS invites distinguished scholars and speakers from around the world to Qatar to speak to faculty and students and to collaborate on research projects and publications. All CRS speaking events are free and open to the Georgetown community and wider public. Currently, CRS is hosting a number of thought-provoking online lectures. Visit our website to learn more. Whether you're looking to buy your textbooks for class, you need school supplies, or you want to wear your Hoya spirit with pride, the GUQ bookstore is where you'll find everything you need. Our campus bookstore is the go-to source for all your course textbooks, Georgetown apparel, gift and spare items, stationery, greeting cards, snacks, phone credit, diploma frames, and more. Since 2009, GUQ faculty and staff have published over 100 books, and you can find many of them for purchase from the bookstore as well. And as part of the university's commitment to sustainability, the bookstore carries a variety of sustainable products, ranging from metal and BPA-free water bottles to notebooks, folders, and pens made from recycled materials. Even our displays are often made from recycled materials to encourage and promote sustainability. The global classroom is one way that GUQ incorporates state-of-the-art technology into its educational model. This classroom is a mirror image of a room in Washington, D.C. Through webcams, microphones, and video conferencing, this room allows students in both Doha and D.C. to take the same class, interacting with each other in real time. Thank you for joining us. Take care and stay safe. 
Hoya Saksa!